What's the problem if they caught the guy? My nephew, Randy. He disappeared not long past. And what you just saw? The kid was wearing Randy's shoes. Ah, oh, Jesus. Randy's disappearance. You know anything else? My sister and I don't get along that well. Uh, I don't know much. Just wish I could have been there for her when she needed it most. And what, they figured you'd get emotional and kept you off the case? More like a restraining order. Won't let me anywhere near it. Gonagal took the lead on it. Lazy-ass gonk. And so far, he ain't accomplished shit. Nigga! He wants everyone to experience his agony, feel his pain and suffering. Why the brain dance? What, what's in it for you? Zuleika transformed me into a child of God. It's time I repaid that debt. I want to bear witness to love's existence in a manner that all the lost souls on this wretched earth can understand. Why love? If unconditional love exists, then so must God. It's time the world was reminded of His divine presence. Think of the millions jacked into their feeds like livestock. The children growing up in gang-infested streets. Do they know love? Think of the joy toys on Jig Jig Street. Coked out corpos in their offices. And murderers who stalk the streets. I want to reach them. I will reach them. And think of paid killers like you, V. Have you known love? Do you know what it is? Mother is home. Joshua Stevenson. We meet again. And who are you? My name is V. Go. You are not welcome here. Mrs. El Amar. I have come to beg you for forgiveness. You... You murdered my son. That is something I can never forgive. I truly do regret the pain I have caused you. Out of my house! No! Just go, please! Out! All of you! <laughs> we should leave, really. Please, Mrs. Elamar! Murderer! It's okay, just go! You took my Reuben from me! My child! My son! Let's go back to the car. I just wish I could have talked to Gloria and explained oh. everything. If somehow I thought... I, I thought she'd find it in her heart to forgive me. Time to grab a bite to eat. Where are we eating? Uh, Pai Z. They do a great cup of coffee. Gotta kill a cheesecake at Pai Z. I'm lactose intolerant. How about vegan avocado ice cream, then? How well do you know the city? Why does it matter? I'm just curious. Happen to like it out here is all. You can't know Night City well, ever. It's always changing, always surprising. Part of its charm. Hmm, <laughs> true that.
Take Stevenson inside, grab us all a table. Need a word with our stowaway here. Wait up a sec, I want to talk. So, what do you think about our next big BD star? He's a true believer if I ever saw one. He's a true nutcase. That's what he is. But that's beside the point. If he's as crazy as you say, why is he so important to you? Because Stevenson's got a little something that's in short supply, but in very high demand. That little something's called authenticity. And that brain composed entirely of cat shit at this point. He truly believes what he says. Sounds like the perfect BD actor. Mm-hmm, and one incapable of fucking up in any way. Stevenson could be a fat old fucking gold vein for our studio. And that's my concern because... You're fucking with his mind, asking probing questions. You're making him doubt, and most importantly, jeopardizing my investment. So I'm prepared to pay you double what he's promised you to quietly walk away. Don't do it, V. Fine. Deal. Very wise choice. Fucking pathetic. Don't follow me in. I'll tell Stevenson you said goodbye.
Problem you're calling me? Thought you rejoined the family. Well, I. Yes, I did, but I thought. I suppose that means you're not willing to come, am I right? On my way. Phew. Thanks. That's good to hear. Give me a little more intel. What's your grief? Well, it uh, would be better to. Let me guess. Saul, right? You know me well. Uh huh. See you soon.
Jefferson? Listen, I need your help again. Matters private. Sure. Okay. What's it about? Not on the hollow. Come by. I'll lay it out. Explain everything. Got your back, Jefferson. Not to worry. Great. We'll see you here then. Remember where? Of course. Be there in no time. Well, this is the place. Tick, 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 tick. Hey, V. How you holding up? Been better. I know. Probably not hard to tell. Nice ride. Brand new? Nope. Not in a chatty mood, I see. Not really. Sorry. So, what happened? Needed someone to talk to. Uh-huh. First, take a look. More dead politicians. Just watch it. This is uh, Peter Pan. He in O-Case? You were looking for him? Never heard of him. Didn't cross my desk. What's the problem if they caught the guy? My nephew, Randy. He disappeared not long past. And what you just saw. The kid was wearing Randy's shoes. Ah, oh, Jesus. Randy's disappearance. You know anything else? My sister and I don't get along that well. Uh, I don't know much. Just wish I could have been there for her when she needed it most. And what, they figured you'd get emotional and kept you off the case? More like a restraining order. Won't let me anywhere near it. Gonagal took the lead on it. Lazy-ass gonk. And so far, he ain't accomplished shit. No way I'd let this lie. I know. And that's why I'm asking for your help. So what do we need to do? Can't interrogate the guy because he's a veg, but... We can view his dreams. I'm sorry, dreams? You heard me. Come on, I'll explain on the way. It's an experimental procedure, but it's already yielding results. They record dreams that can be played back as BDs. You got access to these dreams? Not yet, but they keep them in the lab we're headed to now.
okay? Got an appointment? Not exactly. We'll go in together, but, uh... Not through the main entrance. <gasps> We're gonna break the law? We'll find a different way in, and then hustle out quick. Never actually been here, so I'll need your help. Entrance. They have an audit today. Should be a ghost town. No need to be quiet. How'd you know about the audit? I did my homework. <sighs> know where they're keeping the BD? Unlikely the room where they edit the autistic kids' dreams. Should be labeled as Anthony Harris. A few of these rooms we probably don't have to bother with. Hey, River. I think I got it. Found something? Not yet. Anthony Harris. Let's try these drawers. Say, River, why not just have a janitor crack a door for you? Can't risk getting scolded for sniffing around somebody else's River. case. Yoan! What are you doing here? You got kicked off the force! Just suspended, actually. What does she mean by that? He hasn't told you? Yawen, please, listen to me. Aren't you in enough trouble already? Harris kidnapped my nephew. I'm sorry. Really, I am. But we store evidence here. And we have strict protocols. Protocols? I'm talking about his nephew's life here. A child's life. This is an ongoing police investigation. Go, please. Get out now! Listen, you work with badges, right? You know what they're like. Feed them analysis, they'll shit out failure. This type of thinking is the very reason we live in a lawless city. Lawless? Remember your first med school exam? 
You know the one. Past it with flying colors. Gotta remember it. Ladies' room erupted in flame. They evacuated everybody for two hours. I cannot believe you would throw that in my face. I never wish to see you here again. Especially you. You don't know him well, do you? This man is a bastard. Barely know River. We just work together. Do not believe any promise he makes. Good tip, thanks. But we're wasting time. Harris is dream beating. Where is it? He isn't dreaming. What? Why? A bullet damaged his cerebral cortex. We get only dissonant urges. Pieces. I'd like to... Try audiovisual stimulation. But he isn't on the spectrum. A favorite song or movie helps you reach the kids. Might be worth a try. I am aware of the similarity. Hypothalamus stimulation and hormone production. But Harris is not a child. I have never tried the procedure on an adult. Any reason you haven't? Because, unlike River, I went to med school and studied neuroscience. And not by reading about it over someone's shoulder on the metro. Let's try it. We don't even know his preferences. I'll find something. I mean you're willing to try? Just... go. I'll open the front door for you. Let's ride, V. I know exactly where to start. Say, by the way, what do you know about biochips? Arasaka's relic in particular. Well, it's designed to store a person's neural engram. Uh, sorry. Just imagine copying over a person's memories and personality. Right, I get that. More curious what happens if the stored engram overwrites the engrams of the chip carrier. Overwrites? I... I'm not even sure that's possible. Why do you ask? Nah, never mind. Not a big deal. Thanks. Cops seem to like you. Careful this one doesn't start sending you out for donuts. What? No, River's all right. For a cop, you mean? Not every cop's a bastard. Just like not every rocker boy's a narcissistic dickhead. Don't know, V, you ever actually met a rocker boy who didn't fit that description? All in all, no. So, got booted off the force. Uh, suspended. Mayor's death stank to high heaven. Inquest into, kicked under the rug. So, I made a fuss. Not worth asking how you feel about that. Nope. It's just, uh... It's not easy for me to talk about what's biting at my ass. Fair enough. Could tell me where we're headed, though. To Joss's. Randy's mom. She thinks he just ran away from home. For now, keep the kidnapping between us. Tell me about Randy. What kind of kid he is. Petty theft, drugs, running away from home. That kind. Cop uncles really see the best in you. There are people who always find their way into trouble. Randy's one of them. You gonna tell me why we aren't trying to find Harris's apartment? That's a house. I doubt he's keeping his victims in his basement. And besides, we are trying. Wanna see if we can find some connection to Harris at Randy's. Pretty weak lead. Best we can hope for just now. Not 
worried Yawen's gonna toe the line, rat you out to her superiors? Used to be friends. Doubt she'd do that. Plus, not that I'd use it, but I do know one skeleton she'd prefer remain tucked in her closet. You think Yawen will actually help us, all things considered? Yeah. These tiffs of ours always end up the same way. I'll tell you about it over a beer sometime. Sign me up. We find Randy, then we find the bottoms of a few bottles. Won't be my pleasure. It. Sure been a while. He used to come over every weekend. Long time ago. And changed it all since. Places like this never change. Lovely neighborhood. Huh. River. You either got business with me or news about my Randy. Wouldn't drag your butt out here if you didn't. Joss, meet V. So V, is this about my Randy? Randy's been taken. Why didn't you call? Joss, I... Uh... Throw a blanket over the truth, like always. Police caught the guy, but he caught a bullet and he's in a coma, being watched. But where's Randy? We're looking, Joss. Here? Arguing's not gonna help anyone. He's my child. You got no place telling me how to behave. Joss. Listen. We need to look through Randy's things. Why? To find any lead we can. Trust me, Joss. Just don't destroy anything. Randy doesn't like it when anyone pokes through his stuff. Let's go, V. The kids are playing outside. Tell them it's time to eat.
Can't be easy raising three kids on your own. Well, it wasn't any easier with my husband. In fact, the best days were when he didn't come home. There were times I wished he'd disappear for a month just to not have him hang around. That bad, huh? His bike in the highway. That was his world. But at home... Let me tell you a story. This one time he took Dorian into the city. Had some errand to run, just father and son. He came back that night, dead-ass drunk. Raging at me for calling the cops on him. Did you? River found him in some dive and brought Dorian home. Must have been a relief then, when he left. For weeks, I cried every night. My husband was killed. The father of my children. Um, I'm sorry. Randy changed. He locked up. Not to mention the other two I still had to raise. Life was rough with him and without him. Sometimes there's no solution. How'd he die? Thael de Caldos told me he died an honorable death. Whatever the hell that means. They showed me his body, where his face used to be. Couldn't see the honor in that. Let's, um, change the subject. Hang in there, Joss. What's on your mind? Think it's good she learned the truth. That's the trailer. Eyes peeled for details, eh? Uncle River! Monique! Dorian. Hey, guys. Is this your partner? Just a friend. You gonna stay over? We'll see. Your mom's waiting for you at dinner. This is their old trailer. Randy moved in when I bought him a new one. Real hellhole. Like in my good old days. You check around, I'll check the trash. Got some kind of key here. Real fossil. Not quite what we're looking for, no. Drugs? Let's not go there. No. Society's fault. Jeez. I can still see the nicks from those first years we measured the kids. Left his favorite hoodie in the closet. Tainted Overlord. Favorite band. You know him well. Send him an album every year for his B-Day.
Some kind of game here. Shipping code on it. Expensive tech. Randy had the scratch for this? You're joking. No chance Randy could afford hardware like this. Way too pricey. We gotta get in, but I doubt anyone knows the password. Can you crack it? Don't know how, River. Damn. Need to try to guess it then. What could he have... Who's the girl? His ex, Natalie. X in the pig. What's her name? Natalie? Gonna have to keep trying. Woohoo! Liberum Arbitrium. Dark shit. Sound could use work, but you can tell they put blood, sweat, and tears into it. B. Randy looks like his tag. <laughs> uh, give his tag a try. B. Randy. That's not it. Punch this track title. Liberum Arbitrium. That did it! Help me have a look around. Something deeply fucked about that cartoon. My skin's crawling. They caught Harris in a vehicle like that. Blockaded street. Shit, River. I remember that day. He lives close to an old school. True angel of empathy, this guy, huh?
Figured out Randy's identity. Sent him the game as a present. The one you found in his drawer? The same. Shipping code suggests the prick sent it from the Badlands. This guy baited Randy like a pro. River, do you... Are you seeing what I'm seeing? No. There's no way. Why would he do that? Not only did they agree to meet, but it looks like Randy was as excited as any kid on his way to a theme park. Fuck. This creep definitely scrambled Randy's head. Natalie must have been the only person Randy trusted. Can we view this page with a link? Some kind of link. The one Randy wrote about? Let's find out. Hidden page set up by Anthony Harris. Christ. I'm gonna be sick. Jesus, River, this is fucked. Guy preyed on troubled kids. Made habit to target boys like Randy. This is my fault. If I just paid more attention. Just talked with him more. Hey, come on. You're not the one to blame here.
has a file here. Deleted, looks like. But the name's still there. That name? Wasn't the video file on Randy's comp called something like that? Hey, look. The name of this cartoon matches the missing file on Harris's page. That's what we needed to find for Yawin. V, we've got it. Randy must have downloaded it. Sure, but V, don't you get it? This could be the key to Harris's mind. Here's hoping. Hey, uh, can you use any of that Netrunner magic to shake anything else out of this? Not that kind of magician. Oh, okay. We'll have to manage without it. A cartoon, River. Could be what we've been looking for. You said yourself we needed something to get Harris to dream. Send it to Yawin. Right. Send it now. Okay. Says she'll get back to me by morning. And that I am a son of a bitch. And, uh, <laughs> Come on. Let's grab a bite. <laughs>